Um, welcome, you guys uh, uh, all know the rules, I think, at this point. Um, we're going to start with um, an argument for. I like to go for first, and then we'll go against. Should recreational marijuana be legal? Should we be able to smoke marijuana for funsies? Uh, Dimitri, why don't you start us off? Okay, my point is very simple. In Russia, there is a saying, Mayo Tiela, Mayo Tiela, which means my body is my business. Therefore, I strongly <laughs> believe that as an adult, I can be told what to do with my body. It's my right to use it or abuse it or even lose it too. To drink alcohol, to do piercing, to do tattoos, play with fire, getting higher, stuff like that. So legalize it and don't criticize it. Free up the weed that our people need time. Wow. Wow. And it <laughs> rhymed. I mean, pretty, pretty, pretty good opener. Thank you, Dimitri. So your Thank body you. is your right. Other people shouldn't have the right to tell you what to do is exactly. your main point. Very good. Uh, George, yes. Yeah, I will counter that argument from Dimitri because even today, alcohol would probably not be allowed as a food or certainly not as a medicine as in the past. And neither does tobacco because today we know what negative consequences these funds have, also with cannabis or marijuana. That's my point on this other view to Dimitri. Uh, so wait, so I, I, I'm sorry. So you mean, uh, uh, can you repeat just the main point? Yeah, I... I I described the situation in the past. Uh, alcohol uh, would probably uh, not be allowed as food or certainly as a medicine, as in the past. And neither does tobacco, what we know, because today we know what negative consequences these funds have. And uh, Dimitri said, I can do anything with my body and I will counter this. No, that's not true, because in the past, 100 years ago, all the people thought, yes, of course, it's very useful to drink a lot of alcohol or to drink or to smoke uh, more than one cigarette in an hour. And that's not useful for your body. Care of yourself, please. OK, so you're saying you could do whatever you want, but it's not healthy for your body. I'm not that's sure not how that fits into body. the realm of legality because uh, smoking and alcohol is legal in most places. Um, so I, I'm not too sure how how you are saying it should not be legal because of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I think uh, the medicine, especially the science, told us in these days that's not, I would describe it in an easy way, it's not okay to do that for your body. And I think that's the counter argument on his first argument from Dimitri to ah, say, please mm -hmm. don't allow that. Okay, I see. So you're not so much talking about the legality of marijuana. You're just saying, Dimitri saying you can do whatever you want with your body is not correct because you shouldn't do whatever you want with your body because yeah, you could absolutely. you could damage your body yeah, in a way. Absolutely. Okay, th thank you. Thank you, uh, George. Does anyone else have anything to say either for or against on this particular argument? That is your body, your right. Should you be able to smoke marijuana because of that? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, Mete. I am against. Okay, am so, against. okay, wait, okay. So, Mete, there is a raise hand function on Zoom. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can look for it and you can press the button to raise your hand. It's okay, you can speak now, just, just for next time. So, Mete, you are against. Why? Please tell us more. Firstly, this is not universal, in my opinion. For There should be a difference among developed countries and developing countries and underdeveloped countries because using Mariana or smoking Mariana a new cons cons consume consume option and for it earning more money there should be and more time for smoking it but in Africa in South Asia in East Asia in Middle East countries and and it in Eastern Europe there is no money and there is no time for smoking it. This is my first reason. And my second reason, in my opinion, this is not freedom freedom point because this belongs to belong not to 
people's pe willing about liberty and freedom. This is a new capitalist game for us. I think so. And producers and manufacturers earn, earn from it, but people after using some technologies, smoking cigarettes and alcohols, cannot cannot earn any money. Yeah. How can I okay, say so I don't I think, know? Okay, so I My think I see your is... point. I think I see your point. So the first point is that it's a waste of money. Uh, and I'm not too sure about the difference between countries specifically. Maybe maybe people that have money and people that don't have money. And you're saying that people that don't have money spending money on this is an incredible waste of money. And the second point you're, you're making is that if you do smoke, then you won't be able to work and improve your condition, improve your life. Is that what you mean? Okay, we're yeah. kind of moving away from the argument, my body, my right to do what I want. But there was no uh, other person raising their hand. So we can talk about this now. Um, waste of money. Is it a waste of money? Yes, Sergey. Why is it uh, totally a waste of money? For example, you can uh, grow your your own marijuana for free. It's not wasting all your money. <laughs> okay, um, thank you, Sergey. So Sergey is saying that you can grow your own marijuana for free. In that case, you're not wasting any money. Anyone else on the? Uh, money wasting not wasting point no okay let's move on sophia uh should recreational marijuana be legal yes or no why i believe it should not be uh but i see the point why some governments would want to make it legal because just imagine that it's easier to manipulate people who are high and uh who just uh care of nothing but about getting like uh, maybe a new dose of that uh, pleasure uh i can give an example it seems to me that uh, the same uh, went for hippie for instance of course they had slogans that make love not war but i believe these guys could do better if they weren't using marijuana uh, they could try to change the policy of the country uh, instead they preferred to uh, enjoy the life and uh, having it so for government, uh, it uh, might be very, very profitable to distract people from what is happening in the world. Okay, good point. So you're saying that it should not be legal because it is detrimental to the population of a country. They can be more easily manipulated by the government and they uh, will limit themselves in how they can develop their life. Is, is that as these your two main yeah, points? Thank exactly. you. Uh, George, yes. I'm not sure about from from Sophia's side because uh, you mean Sophia crimes goes down when Mariana is legalized. Is that your mm. point? No, I mean that governments can manipulate people who are high. Mm, she's saying so. Uh, what George, do you mean when you say high? Okay, 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 she's saying. She's I saying, didn't catch. She is saying, I think, uh, Sophia, correct me if I'm wrong, that when people smoke marijuana, they get high and they are more easily manipulated because the government knows what they want and they know how to manipulate people that are or who are high. High people, you are saying, uh, Sophia, are more easily manipulated. Yes, yeah, they Morad, lose the ability of rational thinking. Ah, okay, I losing think, the ability of wait, 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 Morad, please. She, they lose the ability of rational thinking. Thank you, Sophia. Morad, <laughs> yes. I think it is just illusion, Sophia. Most point of why it's not legal in marijuana because most of profitable industries, pharmacy industry, because uh, smoking marijuana it's extremely helpful than, for example, drunk vodka or cigarette usual tobacco mm. even if even marijuana you can use for example in massage oil massage it's really uh, exciting and relaxable and uh, helpful or uh, yeah in healthy and healthy in my point of view about waste of money of course waste of money it's about tobacco industry for sure they less a lot of money if today we legalize in marijuana even in in if you raise in your home this uh, marijuana tobacco industry less a lot of money mm. okay so let's backtrack 
<laughs> so you're saying that marijuana is not dangerous like people think, like Sofia is, is saying uh, that it, uh, Boris, it doesn't make let people. Me. Let, let me finish. It doesn't make people high and unable to uh, reason rationally. It even has a lot of great benefits, is what you're saying. And the second point is about uh, money, right? You were saying that uh, marijuana. Uh, would make other companies lose a lot of money or you're saying that marijuana may waste money to people but nothing compared to cigarette companies and other yeah. companies of the same yeah. kind okay thank you Roman and please. and, oh. and so, sorry last last night and uh, marijuana more a soft and gentle drug and uh, okay so you're saying marijuana is not as available. bad as the other drugs Okay, thank you, Morad. Yes, Roman, please. Yeah, I have to say, actually, what uh, it's really a dangerous drug. Yeah, because uh, I read in this article when you uh, send us for preparing. Yeah, uh, that's actually uh, in use in people uh, before twenty-four. Some actually psychose in the brains. Yeah, some like this, and actually it's um, uh, influence in their motivation. If talking about work. In general, if you're working in some uh, establishment, I don't know, yeah, entertainment, uh, and you uh, actually consume this product, uh, that means actually what uh, you unmotivated, unmotivated, uh, and you very, I don't know, an activity person, yeah, it's actually uh, big uh, consequences after consuming, and this also drag, yeah, like. Uh, uh, cigarettes or alcohol may be a little bit less but in my point yeah it's like a bridge uh, to something higher in general actually it's in use uh, more addiction in the future some like this okay, and so, it mm -hmm. is bad yeah so you're you're talking you're staying on the uh the dangers of marijuana in general dangerous. while uh sure. sophia maintains it is quite risky uh morad says it is not and you maintain that in your opinion it is actually uh, quite dangerous in the way that it uh, affects you uh, mentally before the age of 24 and uh, also takes away your ability to to work in life in general okay yeah, and in this article, can, can I uh, add something? In this article also actually mentioned about what it's induced also bronchite and uh, um, asthma. Yeah, something like this. All of this okay. breathing uh, system. Maybe it's true. Okay. okay. Uh, so, yes. Yeah, so, in other conditions from the article. Um, cool. Anyone else on maybe the health uh, aspect of marijuana? Is it really that bad? Is it not? Anyone? Archim, do you have anything you would like to add? Yeah, yeah, I just, I just have heard, and I uh, disagree with something, and with something I agree. Uh, if, if, if to talk about health, you know, we here uh, now we are talking about uh, recreational purposes, not medicine, not for medicine. So for sure, uh, marijuana. Uh, can be used for, and uh, it is uses for uh, medicine purposes, and it's okay. But for recreational, uh, I'm not so sure, <laughs> and uh, I I agree with Sofia and uh, with other, but um, uh, but uh, maybe maybe I have uh, 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 my my own view. Maybe we should talk about uh, just uh, um, oh, oh, oh. maybe we should talk about just uh, we have to prohibit it maybe uh, for marijuana for recreational you uh, for recreational purposes like in general uh, okay you, you like alcohol and uh, we for sure marijuana should not be like uh, should not be distributed like alcohol and like uh, cigarettes. Okay, why? Uh, you say for sure, but that's the point. I of mean, this I mean, I, I, I mean, I, I mean, so um, <laughs> I don't know how to say so so uh, massively. I don't know. So okay. when you can buy uh, on every corner and you can use maybe. Okay, uh, why, why not? Be some... Why not? 
Because uh, okay, just just maybe one point uh, from others. Uh, because we ha- because we have enough. We have enough, and uh, it's not good what we see with alcohol and with other additional uh, additional things. But uh, again, from my view, uh, we can maybe we can uh, compare marijuana like with um, mm, like with uh, oh, whoa 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 whoa. Uh, um, these uh, games, you know, mm. oh, gambling. gambling, gambling, yeah. Okay. Maybe it should be regulated. May I, sh- uh, may I, uh, maybe there should be some special places for that. I don't know. So marijuana <laughs> casinos. <laughs> yeah, marijuana casinos. That's something next like week this. debate. <laughs> may- <laughs> All right. Th- thank you so much, Archam. So basically, you're saying that we already have enough bad substances going around there's alcohol cigarettes we don't need another one is what you're saying we don't need to make this one legal it's obviously not good for your health and there's no reason we should make it available at every street corner right okay thank you uh dmitri let's circle back to you then <laughs> okay uh, i want to address the health aspect uh, about what what our men have just mentioned that it's bad for your health and all i believe we should be consistent because well uh, smoking is just as damaging to your health. Alcohol may be even more damaging because it, it can cause uh, car accidents because of, well, driving under influence and stuff. And uh, it also it is also widely believed that uh, junk food uh, can also be addictive and it can be just as harmful cause uh, any, any, uh, lots of diseases, heart diseases and uh, uh, stuff like that. Uh, whereas uh, their usage uh, may be a little bit, just a little bit restricted, but they are not banned. And I haven't seen any McDonald's uh, being uh, shut down anywhere else in the world uh, because of uh, because of uh, junk food being harmful to your health. So I believe there is some hypocrisy about it. We should be consistent. You should you should be, you should ban all of this all of this stuff, or we should legalize all this stuff. Oh, yeah. that, thank, you. Hope. thank you, Mitri. So you're saying that uh, we have to be consistent when it comes to banning uh, harmful substances. Why yeah. ban marijuana when we're not banning alcohol and cigarettes and junk food, which are proven to have negative uh, impact on our health as well? Uh, exactly. And, and may, may I add something to, to this? I, I, I believe it, it, it was Murad who said this, that... Um, uh, legalizing marijuana can lead to uh, tobacco producers losing their profits. I believe that there is also economical issue being involved in all this uh, legalizing or dealing or banning marijuana problem. Okay, so uh, another point is that maybe the reason it's illegal is because of big tobacco, it's called. It's uh, tobacco companies would lose too much money. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much, Dmitry. Yes, George. Yeah, I'm not sure about, uh, I'm pro or, or, or con on this uh, topic because this, this interesting topic it, is it do, so It doesn't hard. matter, George. We're here to practice no, it, English and have so some hard fun. to understand. <laughs> and I will share uh, one other side of this uh, topic. Uh, I think this list of pros and cons arguments illustrate us some of the difficulties and prejudices in our drug policy. And that's worldwide the problem, I think. And um, this is always about is a different view of the humanity. Is it, or, or the other way, are people able to make independent, what Dimitri said before, on responsible decision when dealing with dangerous or other seductions? I think, are they even allowed to do that? I, I have more questions after this debate <laughs> from pros and cons than before. Good. Good. Sometimes the questions are more interesting than the answers. Yeah, and yeah hard absolutely, to find. absolutely. <laughs> All right. Th- thank you very much, George. Uh, yes, Morad. Uh, I think, like I said, uh, marijuana, it's most of uh, benef- profitable, extremely profitable business, business all world. And now all, go- all government, all country uh, try to solve these problems. How is a, I don't know, who and how uh, can earn more money it's just this stuff but as a as a uh, opinion is just distract opinion population so 
So and in your even so, though mm. e even those is quite helpful about healthy marijuana. I didn't hear even I never was uh, wasn't in smoker. I didn't smoke any cigarette, any uh, marijuana. But my friend told for it's marijuana more helpful and healthy than cigarette and tobacco for sure. Okay, thank you very much. So in your opinion, Morat, it's money. It's just about money. It's just yeah, for sure. That's all about money. Policy is just about money. And marijuana, yes, legal course. or illegal, just comes down to money for governments. And that's how, that, that's your opinion, right? Thank you very much, Morad. Yeah, yeah. Uh, anyone else? New argument, maybe? New direction? Yes, Sophia. And you are muted, by the way. Yes. Yes, yeah, so I muted myself. So, yes. Uh, you know, Murad, I would argue because um, uh, I discovered that uh, marijuana, it uh, contains uh, two uh, components. So, THC and another one, C something I forgot. So, the first component is responsible for uh, making our brains uh, high. And uh, it may cause, as I have discovered pre while preparing, so it may cause psychosis. So, and it was said in one of the videos that people who are prone to become schizophrenic just because they have these genes, they, it might be activated by uh, smoking uh, weed. So, uh, I would call it dangerous. So, for me, it's a kind of a, a Russian roulette because you never know how your brain would react. So, I... Uh, I believe that it can be used for medical purposes, as you said, but if people use it for the other purpose, yeah, to get high, one can never know how it will turn out. Maybe you can uh, really? end up uh, in an uh, asylum, mental asylum. Yes, Murad, please, because she's she's yes, talking directly yes, to your point. You, Le let me let me finish. I'm gonna yes, give you a yes, to I got it. Your your uh, your point, I get it. But Sophia, even in cigarette and uh, alcohol, have limitation. It's your own dose. For example, if you have drunk alcohol 80 degrees, you can quite easy diet. And uh, what kind of effect do you have in the brain? Nobody don't know. If you drunk okay, alcohol so, 80 degrees, Sophia, or cigarette, or tobacco. Hmm. Thank you, Murad. So Sophia is saying that it is a dangerous substance. THC can, um, in people, likely to develop schizophrenia can uh, start an episode. Uh, I think that's what you were saying. And Murad yeah. is saying that every uh, many other substances are equally or maybe more dangerous with risk of death even is your point about alcohol. Um, thank you. Uh, yes, Roman. Yeah, Murad said about dose. It's pretty interesting because uh, I want to mention uh, interesting thing. When we come to coffee shop, you can order some cake yeah or another uh, food yeah with marijuana and in this actually product generally a little bit more uh, this tnc like sophia uh, said THC. yeah THC, is it th right? thc thc yeah 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 mm. and these things actually uh, they're a little bit more than enough yeah something like this and uh, you don't control your dose you just eat and uh, it's uh, in use in the future big consequences yes this stuff okay. matter of producer let's uh let's let's keep our hands raised to try and keep the conversation going all around the room um so roman is saying that you don't control the dose when you uh, consume edibles they're called like brownies in amsterdam uh and mm -hmm. and you may put yourself at risk anyone anything to say i will uh, add uh I will yes. add something about Roman's uh, prediction because I mean, I'm not sure about, but I heard in these videos, you can't overdose uh, the cannabis, but you can overdose the alcohol or tobacco. That's totally clear. And that's a pro argument for, for this stuff, for cannabis, I think. You can't overdose this. Yes, of course, we heard a lot about in these videos that the THC is more than uh, decreasing in the last 10 years in the plants and whatever but i mean it's not possible to overdose with cannabis yeah i was in the uh in the prince ea rap uh, video right uh, yes, yes there are true. zero yeah. cases of overdose yeah. from uh, from can from cannabis actually uh, interesting point thank you george uh, yeah. uh wait more right please uh let's go let's go around someone else maybe mete what do you think about all this mete maybe <laughs> just just moment wait after after one speaking i i am gone i gone okay 
I am waiting now. You're, you're waiting. You're waiting for something. Okay, <laughs> I, I will. I will give you a little time then. Um, Roman, yes. Yeah, I uh, actually have argument for yeah something like this. Let's do it because let's, let's um, move on. Yeah, yeah. Uh, for me, actually, important to legalize is because we have a big black market, and if we don't want when. Uh, uh, what our children wants uh, can to buy something, some drugs, yeah, in the black market. I don't know, in darknet or in other things. We sh it should be legalized, yeah, because we are can to um, restrict maybe our children to buy it's illegal, <laughs> something like this, and uh, it's um, will be maybe more uh, helpful for for them, like restriction to go and buy it in the yard. Yeah, I think the underlying point that you're making is very interesting that that making it illegal is actually benefiting the criminal underworld is is kind of your mm -hmm. point under under what you're saying about children, I think. Uh, let's have uh, Dimitri, please. Oh, you are muted. Sorry. Second, I want to add to the point that uh, the the um, uh, cannabis is, is a waste of money and uh, also to link it to what Roman has just said about well legalizing it and decriminalizing it i believe that uh, making marijuana legal will lead to well competition and uh, a free market and stuff and will drive prices down so it, it'll become cheap i mean already has right that's exactly what happened in many parts of the us isn't it Mm -hmm. where they uh, decriminalized it. Uh, okay, Morad, final word, please. I think my point, in my point of view, of our chief, uh, it's marijuana shouldn't be abused, any people. This point can be, uh, have, can have consequences. Okay, uh, so you're not against making it legal, just it shouldn't be abused, like like most things i imagine uh thank you so much let me uh, let me end the stream there for those of you watching live uh thanks for tuning in and see you see you later <laughs> Bye.